Um, is a rising senior with a major in marketing. She has worked in the library for three years, both in the Department of Reference and Instruction as well as the Department of Outreach. America was the recipient of the 2017 to 2018 L1U Outstanding Sophomore Employee Award. Please join me to welcome America. Hi everyone. When selecting this poster, I was taken aback by all of Mr. Swanson's beautiful and vibrant art. I was initially drawn to this poster, called Noah, by the cool blues and greens that act in contrast with the striking warmth in the center of the poster. I particularly enjoyed the fish <laughs> and how easily their curved bodies blended into the waves, as well as the subtle heart patterns that you can see in the boat. Ultimately, I selected the poster because I love that it calls for us to be responsible human beings for the non-human beings that we share our earth with. The 2015 quote by Pope Francis atop the poster reads, because all creatures are connected, each must be cherished with love and respect. For all of us as living creatures are dependent on each other. This could not be more true. As humans, we have the privilege of being at the top of the food chain. We have the most power and thus the most responsibility to care for the creatures beneath us. This idea has been with me since I was young. When I was smaller, I used to look down at the ground when I was walking to make sure that I wouldn't accidentally step on a snail or worm, which I still do. I also had many conversations with my mom about why we ate animals. Now, many people choose to cut out meat out of their diets due to health reasons, but as a 10-year-old, my curiosity and my questions stem from empathy. Although these were small actions to take, they led to a much bigger mindset that I now have about animals and our responsibility towards them. What this responsibility looks like for me can look different to other people. For example, one of the big things I go out of my way to do is to purchase beauty products that have not been tested on animals. However, this does not mean that everyone has to behave this way. Whether we choose to live a vegan lifestyle, drive an eco-friendly car, because our earth is also another creature that we must care for, or simply treat the creatures we encounter with love and respect, all our efforts make a difference. I'm grateful to Mr. Swanson for creating the art that allowed me to share these thoughts with you today. The warm, fiery boat in the center of the poster represents hope for our planet that nurtures us and hope for the creatures that we share our home with. Art truly has the power to impact us and act as a catalyst for change. So I am thrilled that Mr. Swanson chooses to create art around social justice. I also participated as a student curator for last year's summer exhibit, and it was a wonderful experience that I wouldn't have had if I was an, um, a library employee. When I was given the chance to participate again this year, I did not hesitate. It's such a unique opportunity for me as a business student to interact with art and reflect on it and share my thoughts with you. Mr. Swanson's art is incredibly inspiring and I hope you all enjoy looking at the gallery. Thank you. <laughs>